Canada, stop number two. We are headed to Lake Louise from Banff, and it's only about an hour down the road, uh, which is a little uncommon for this uh, bit of a road trip we're doing, as it's not a full day's drive. Honestly, we don't know much about Lake Louise. It's got a ski hill, it's got a lake, uh, it's got a gigantic Fairmont Hotel right on the lake, supposed to be super beautiful, ice skating, uh, fire pits right behind the hotel. I don't know what we're going to get into, so it's going to be a little bit more adventure this time around. So let's go check it out. We got a super late start this morning. Um, we slept in because neither of our alarms went off. Oops. Um, so we just finished up breakfast and we're sitting here in the parking lot of Lake Louise and we're about to head up and go skiing. Well, that's gonna be good on camera. Oh. It has a stuck. We just finished up skiing at Lake Louise and it was a really good mountain. Like really actually enjoyed all of the terrain there. It was a really good mix of like there was some steep stuff, some steep bumps, really, really awesome tree runs. Um, there was one specific canyon that I absolutely loved skiing down. 
But there was also some really great, like, fast groomers. Huge terrain park, too. Not that we went in it. Well, Nathan went in it. I, I don't really do terrain parks. But, um, yeah, really good mix of stuff. But now, now that we are done skiing, we are going to head over to, to the lake, Lake Louise, and um, hopefully get to skate, ice skate a little bit. And um yeah i don't i don't really know what else it's late afternoon i think it's like 4 15 4 30 so sun should be setting here in a in a couple of hours so we're going to try to catch the sunset maybe skate on the lake at night um, which i've heard is really really awesome so i'm gonna go check it out see what we can find Lake Louise was absolutely awesome. Uh, the thing that really stood out to me the most were just the views from the top of the mountain, just 360 degree views of all the super prominent peaks around the valley. It was just absolutely gorgeous and we had such a good time and the skiing was wonderful. The weather was even better. But our time there is coming to a close and now it's time to head on down the road about three hours away to a little place called Revelstoke. Thanks for watching. We can't wait to take you on more adventures. You want to travel with us in real life? Click this link up here. You want to subscribe to stay current on all of our van life and adventure travels? Click this link down here. And lastly, if you want to binge watch all of our videos, this link down here. Until next time, we'll see you later. Bye.